hey guys welcome to my channel i am here today to talk a little bit about face masks <laughs> mainly just sheet masks anytime that i get the ability to do a face mask i am going to even if it's late and even if i'm exhausted it's 11 17 right now and i don't feel good like at all um just saying i'm fine it's just i think i am coming down with a cold or something i'm feeling like my throat kind of hates me and my nose has been kind of sniffly today so like partly my i'm like do i have allergies but like i've never had allergies before in my life so i don't know but i'm here and i'm happy that i'm here i wouldn't be anywhere else to be completely honest making a video to me is so fun and so important in my life and in my weeks. I also just really quickly wanted to kind of go off topic for a second and just say thank you to everybody that was so supportive of my last video. If you don't know what video I'm talking about, the link to it will be at the end of this video. So stick around and you'll be able to click on it once this video is done. I got so much love, so much support, I got text messages, I got DMs, whatever those are called. I feel like I'm like already getting really old. Sometimes I'm like, what's the lingo? I've met some amazing people, new subscribers um, that are going on this journey as well. And it just means the world to me and it makes me so happy. Just that extra boost of support and knowing that other people are there as well, doing it kind of with me on their own journey and we're, we have our own things going, but just like knowing that I'm not alone, it just made me keep going all week long. So I just wanted to say thank you so much. I just got done walking four miles and I weigh myself on Monday. So we'll see, we'll see how it goes, but I have been feeling really good. I'm feeling the results. And anyways, it's all really good. I don't want this video to become a, like second video of last week's although that will be coming probably within the next few weeks if you haven't told me your story yet leave it in the comments below tell me your journey and um we're in this together so thank you um back to face masks i am really excited for this face mask and i hope <laughs> it's good it's from trader joe's so i feel like it can't be bad. I love Trader Joe's. I don't know who doesn't like Trader Joe's. You may have your reasons and that's totally fine, but I love Trader Joe's. I don't go as often as I should. And so my sister and I just went the other day and we're going to start going more frequently because we're trying to eat better. So we were kind of walking down every aisle and we got to the beauty aisle and that's where like the soaps and the, you know, all the things are. And I was like, ooh, this is fun, you know, like what's here? And I quickly was like, oh my gosh, do they have face masks? So I was like scouring the, the aisle. I was like searching. And this little baby popped up. And I was like, okay, yes, please. I'll take two. So I did. <laughs> I took two. It was $1.99. It's very comparable in the world of face masks and sheet masks. You just can't go wrong. But I'm hoping that it is a good mask. That way I can use this, this one another time. It's Trader Joe's brand and it says rich hydrating face sheet mask. It soothes and revitalizes dull and tired skin with hyaluronic acid, honey, chamomile extract, turmeric extract, green tea extract, pomegranate extract, rosehip oil, blue algae extract, and camellia oil and propolis extract. It's 100% cotton sheet mask and natural cucumber fragrance. I think I botched some of those words. The camellia oil, I have never heard of that. It says for the directions, it says cleanse face and dry thoroughly, remove mask from the packet and peel off the film liner. Apply mask gently over your face and smooth the mask to ensure good skin contact. Leave on and relax for up to 20 minutes. I love that. I cannot tell you how excited that makes me. Like, honestly, I don't want masks that are only gonna be on my face for five minutes. 
I'm putting a lot of work or effort into being ready for a face mask. And it also is like an experience for me. I wanna like feel pampered and feel like all of this good stuff is like soaking into my skin. So I guess it depends on the face mask, obviously. I wanna put a face mask on and actually have it be worth my time. So 20 minutes to me is like the perfect amount of time. If even if it's like 10 minutes is like, okay, it's fine, I'll do it, but I'd rather not. Like if it's a 15 to 20 minute face mask, I'm in. I'm not at the spa, but I wanna feel kind of like I am. Remove and pat any remaining serum into the skin. It says optionally apply face moisturizer for maximum hydration. Use daily, weekly, monthly, or as needed for an extra hydration boost. Oh, it's also, there's been no animal testing on it. That's cool. All right, so let me go wash my face and then we'll get started. Okay, face is washed. Oh, I have an eyelash. Make a wish. <sighs> Yay. My face might look a little bit red from um, just washing it. And that's because I exfoliated while I washed my face. Um, when I'm not doing an exfoliating mask, obviously, I'm going to exfoliate my face. That way, all of this goodness has the prime opportunity to seep, drop that, <laughs> to seep like really deep in my skin. Now my face is dry, it's clean, and it's ready to do this mask. So, here we go. So it's just a typical sheet mask and it's always freezing cold when you put it on your face at first. So here we go. Ooh, that's a nice smelling cucumber. Is that folded in on the inside? Okay, wait, here we go. I had to get the rest of the nose. It was folded in on the inside. Okay, this smells super good. I just have to say the smell Reminds me of a spa. Sometimes I like to fold these flaps over. I think it's personal preference. And it's probably also the mask. It just depends. Depends on who you are, depends on all that. I, I Sometimes they get a little too close to my outer eye. So you, obviously you don't want it going into your eye. I need to set a timer, but I can't because my phone is currently recording me doing this. So that's fun. I have my watch timer on my watch to the rescue. And the more that I talk, the more that this moves off of my face. So then I keep fixing it. So I feel like I'm just constantly fixing while I'm talking. Maybe I should just keep it, like I should just hold it in place like while I'm talking to you. So Cameron's out. He is actually seeing the new Avengers movie. He's there for the midnight showing tonight. It's Thursday night. So that's fun. Next week, we are going to be in California and I'm really, really excited about it and soak up some, some Cali sunshine. Um, maybe even go to Disneyland. That's our hope. Okay, I've been going for eight minutes and this is like literally like off my face. So like basically if you don't talk, you're probably just fine. Okay, so now that it's completely stretched out because I talk too much, um, <laughs> I'm gonna take this off. There's still quite a bit on my face. So now I'm just gonna rub it all in. It feels really good on my skin. The camera actually is picking it up as if my face is like really red and it's really not, I promise you. It does have a little bit of a pinky tone to it, but it's not irritated, it's not painful, it's not burning, it's none of those things. It's kind of sticky now. It does kind of give it a healthy glow, if you will. So I'm really digging that. The stickiness is going away, by the way. It's not as sticky. Okay, so I really, really liked this face mask. This is the second one. This is the one that I just used. I definitely am going to use it again. I give this product a two thumbs up. I'm really excited to use this again. I will purchase this again. I love Trader Joe's. I am not affiliated with Trader Joe's in any way. This is not a sponsored video. Um, this is strictly just me sharing products, trying them, reviewing them for no good reason other than I just wanted to. If you have any other face masks that are like your faves, please tell me in the comments below, even if they're not sheet masks. I am a sucker for face masks. If you haven't subscribed yet, do that now. Click that subscribe button. 
also click the bell notification that's right next to or around the subscribe button somewhere. I have actually no clue where it is, but click it because it notifies you every time I make a new video and I make a new video every Friday. Stay tuned for our California adventures next week. I might go live on YouTube. I might go live on Instagram. So go follow me on Instagram or whatever social media account you want. All the links are below. Thank you guys for being here. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your support from last week's video as well. Go watch that video after this if you haven't seen it yet. Um, and that's it. So I will see you guys next week. Bye.